Hello and welcome to the latest installment of This Week in Chesterfield. I'm Teresa Boniface with Constituent and Media Services here to tell you about some of the things happening in your community for the week of January 22nd. On Tuesday, there's a career readiness workshop being offered by Virginia Career Works at Metadale Library from 11 a.m. to noon. If in this new year you'd like to find a new career, the representatives from the Career Works can help you. Registration is required. Then on Friday, head over to the Perkinson Center where the Richmond Symphony will be presenting the Four Seasons at 7.30 p.m. There's also a pre-concert talk that begins at 6.30. Tickets are $30 for adults, $10 for college students with an ID, and children are free. Also that night, Swift Creek Mill Theater will begin holding performances of Brooklyn the Musical. Showtimes begin Friday and Saturday at 8 p.m., but check their website for more chances to get your tickets, which are $49. Then it's a busy winter Saturday around the county. Starting that morning as author Libby McNamee visits North Courthouse Road Library from 10.30 to 11.30. Her talk, which is part of Chesterfield's celebration of the upcoming 250th anniversary of the American Revolution, will focus on one of the year's battles of the book titles, Susanna's Midnight Ride. There'll be a Q&A as well, and registration is required. That afternoon, head over to the Perk, and you can check out the new gallery opening for Eugene Van Gogh called A Retrospective of the Last 25 Years. From 2 to 4 p.m., celebrate the opening of this exhibit with light food, cash bar, and of course, the art. And also on Saturday afternoon, there's a tea making workshop being held at Ettrick Matoka Library from 2 to 4 p.m. Escape the cold with afternoon tea from Savory Blends Tea Company and discover new teas and tea ingredients. Then mix and name your own tea blend that you get to take home with you. Lastly, there's only a few more weeks left to recycle your live Christmas tree free of charge at both the Northern and Southern Area Convenience Centers. Now through February 4th, you can drop off those live trees as long as all the lights and decorations have been removed. Check to the General Services webpage on chesterfield.gov for more information. As always, we're accepting your kindness campaign submissions anytime. If you see random acts of kindness around the county, we want to hear all about them. Go to our website and search This Week in Chesterfield for more information on all the things we just talked about. That's it for this week. Take care, everybody.